So, about the house. It is blowing up online. I live in Creve Coeur. I know. I've never seen this I house. Do you? It's so cool. Yeah. I, I, yeah, it's kind of tucked away. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Gosh. Mm-hmm. I'd buy it if I could afford it. Um, okay. So, <laughs> let's, yeah, just talk about it. You want to sell it. Um, did you, had you been owning it since you left? Or, I mean, you didn't live in it the whole time since you've left, or have you been living in it? No, so yeah, I mean, I bought it um, after I signed an extension because I thought I would be in St. Louis, you know, longer term. Um, lived in it for the the one year, and then um, after the trade, um, I was fortunate to be able to rent it to Judge Yurko, so he's been living in it uh, the past couple years, um, and so kind of kept it within the within the family, I guess you could say. But um, yeah, now that he's moved on and I don't quite know as many guys over there. Um, it just, it just felt like the time to, to sell it and, and, uh, and move on. Got it. So, um, I've only seen the picture that you tweeted or put on Instagram, whatever of the outside. Mm-hmm. Uh, it definitely looks unique. What makes it unique and what did you, what did you love about it? Cause you didn't build it, right? You bought it. Correct. I, I bought it and, um, I remember, I think Upon seeing it, the the day we Mary, my realtor, took me on some on a tour of some homes. This was the last one I saw, and it was a it was a no brainer for me. It's got a kind of cool modern um, feel to it, and you know, it just felt unique and kind of resort like. And um, I I knew that was the house for me, I guess you could say. And um, I think uh, one of my favorite parts of it is just the pool and the really nice. Um, patio area kind of enclosed by trees it was just kind of very peaceful and it was a it was a good spot for me um when i got in there we did a couple of cool things my wife um helped me not renovate but we put up some really nice wood paneling on a couple of the walls and tried to make it our own a little bit and felt really good about that and now that i have a home here in california we're doing very similar things um because we loved it so much there, um, but yeah, maybe maybe someone else can enjoy that at that house. It would be a good family house at four bedrooms. Have you guys announced what you're going to list it at? Yeah, it's on the Zillow. It's uh, one point four five. Okay, it's just sometimes um, Zillow is not accurate, so I didn't know if that was Zillow was the one point four five on Zillow was correct. Yeah, we we did a coming soon on Zillow, and then um, we don't have it staged yet. Um, but once it's staged, we'll do some pictures of the inside and. Um, then it will be officially released, I think, in a couple weeks or week and a half, something like that. Yeah, November 7th, right? So what? Um, how many years did you live there? Um, I was there one year. Oh, you said um, that. Okay. But then we – it was it was nice. The year um, that we bought it, We uh, I brought my entire family out to, to St. Louis, and we stayed there for about a week. Um, in the off season, just because it was it was my first home, yeah, obviously, and um, you know, I wanted all my family to come enjoy it. So we we hung out there for a while, and then I think we went back another time. So we get a little bit of use out of it, um, and uh, you know, it's shoot, we had I think twelve or thirteen people staying there, and I got some little cousins. So we had a there's a downstairs basement area. Had some blow up mattresses, but there was enough beds for everyone. It was it was really a lot of fun bringing them all the way out from California. So obviously, as a professional ball player, you go around all the time. You know, you probably spent your summers in leagues and high school. I mean, you you always were living somewhere that wasn't really home, right? So, mm-hmm. what kind of characterized for me what it was like to finally buy your first home and move in and get to live there and you could actually paint stuff and put wood paint yeah. up and you could actually <laughs> you know it wasn't somebody else's home or a rental or whatever i mean what what is it like to finally have your own first piece of land and home right yeah it was it was a great feeling especially being kind of living a bit of a nomadic lifestyle and you know the minor leagues and then having off seasons in certain places um you know staying with my parents at home so it i never was able to kind of like sink my teeth into somewhere and, and it just be mine and make decisions you know like you're always you know when you're renting apartments you gotta follow the rules of everything and um you know, it was honestly cool just to like decorate some walls and put some art up um because that's something i just for for, for 
went and um it was it was cool to personalize little areas and um it was it was a fun project kind of for my wife and i and um you know i think i think that was a a, f- a fun time going through that and, and starting to have something that was that was mine and it's kind of like with my first car i never want to give up it's, it's hard for me to <laughs> have to give this one up um that's just the, the way it has to be best memory from the house best memory um one of my favorite things as i was talking about the outdoor um a couple of buddies greg garcia and randall gritchick at the time we'd come over and we'd have a little little fire listen to music and and hang out by the pool um you know those those nights were really special also bringing my parents out and, and showing them for the first time was was really cool um and they were i don't know if shocked but when i was telling them i was going to buy this house all from afar and they hadn't seen it and i was just trust me it's going to be a good one and when they came out and saw it they were they were static and that was a really cool feeling Whoever buys it, if they wanted a signed ball to put in the house, you think you can make that happen? I think I can make that happen. 